Good morning, Revive Youth, Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube, or whoever's watching. I was challenged to share my story on how I found Jesus and how much His power is working for me. I was born and raised in a Christian family. My grandpa's a pastor up in Washington. Um, so my family has jumped from church to church, or it jumped from church to church when we loved, lived in Washington. And, th and then when I was about maybe 10, we moved. We moved over here to Hillsborough, Hillsborough, Oregon, and we had this one church we went to. It just didn't click with us, and so me and my mom were in Idaho, and my dad was church looking some more, and I was in fourth grade, and so then my dad found East River, and he's like, this is our church. And then, I, so, uh, what, I think it was the first time I went to Kid Life, I did not like it. I was in the hallway crying, I did not want to go in. And then, I started making friends in Kid Life. And, I started to love it because I had friends. And so, I was in Kid Life until 6th grade. Well, after 6th grade. And then 7th grade, I moved up to uh, Revive Youth. And I loved it because Chase and Keely were my pastors. And it was awesome. And so I've been in youth group ever since. And then it was awesome. So, um, so that was my story on that. But then... When I really felt Jesus' power was when we went to Young Saints. It wasn't really then, but during Young Saints, so there's us youth call it falling, where uh, Jesus like pours all of, not all of his power, but enough to make make us like unconscious and fall on the ground, and like it's awesome. So at Young Saints, I didn't, I didn't fall, but like it was an amazing encounter. But then after Young Saints, I got home. I think it was either that day or the day after, and I fell. Like I walked into my parents, uh, I walked into my parents' bedroom and like I called them in there and. It was awesome. I was like laying on their bed, singing and worshiping, and like I, w I wasn't conscious of it, and it was awesome. And I just felt like totally overcome by Jesus's power, and it was amazing. So, whoever is watching this, I want to challenge you to share your story on. Maybe you don't walk with Jesus, but I want you to share your story on, even if you do or you don't, I want, to sh I want you to share your story on what you think about Jesus. Thank you.